Good morning, my brothers and my sisters. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. This morning, I just want to breathe a prayer of comfort. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. In these trying times. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. And so this morning, Father God, we just want to lift up, Almighty God, all your children this morning. Father, you are God this morning, and there is none like you. Rabo Shete Yanda Yalabasata. This morning, Father God, I just ask that even now, Lord God, that you'll overshadow us with your presence. Father God, we just want to be close to you this morning, Father God, in these trying times. Father God, for every family member that is affected, Almighty God, with this COVID-19, this virus, Lord. Hallelujah, Jesus. Oh, Father God, we just want to put all the family members before you this morning. Lord, we lift you up. Lord, we magnify you. Father God, you rule and you reign. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. And so, Father God, this morning, comfort them, Father, because you are our comforter. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Reassure them that all is well, Lord Jesus. Nothing has been lost. Hallelujah. Because you are still God who sits high and look low. You are the God who rules, who reigns, who sits on the circle of this hurt. Oh, Father God, you know our circumstances. So comfort their hearts for those who are in the hospital. Father God, for those who have showed up positive, for those who have showed up negative, Lord God, for those who are waiting on results. Comfort their hearts, Father God. Speedy result, speedy result, speedy healing this morning, Father, for those that are affected. Lord God, we want to put this world before you, Lord God, this morning. Father God, we want to put this world before you this morning. You said, if my people that are called by my name will humble themselves and pray, turn from their wicked ways, hallelujah, you will hear from heaven that, God, you will heal our land. Father God, we pray this morning, Father, for each and everyone this morning, especially those that are on the front line the doctors, the nurses, hallelujah, the soldiers, the police officers, hallelujah, those that are just there, mighty God, exposing themselves, Lord God, to keep our loved ones safe, almighty God. Father God, we ask that God, you will be with them and cover them under your blood this morning. Father God, we put the leaders of this world before you, not just the leaders of Jamaica, but the leaders of this world before you, Lord Jesus. We pray, Lord God, that they will seek you like never before. And for those who don't know you, Lord God, I pray that they will look into themselves and know that there is a God. Because all that they are doing and everything that they are doing, Father God, remind them that they cannot lean on their own strength. Rabu Shete Yanda Yalabasata. This morning, Father, turn up like never before. Father God, we can't force your hands and tell you what to do because you're a God, do what you please, when you please, and how you please. But Father God, I know that this storm will pass. Hallelujah. Father God, you give us your word. You said, Father God, Jesus, Father, that you are God. You said that we must seek you. You said that we must call upon you in times of trouble. And this is troubling times now, Lord God, where your people need you more than ever, Lord Jesus. Father God, we need you like never before. And so this morning, Father God, take full control. Take full control this morning. Take full control this morning. Take full control from in the hospitals. Take full control, mighty God, from every country, Lord Jesus. Father God, from every continent this morning, Father. Father God, this pandemic thing, Father God, that is taking over the world, we know that the devil come to kill, steal, and to destroy. But we can stand on your promises this morning that you have already sent your son to die on the cross that we may have life and have it more abundantly. And so this morning, Father God, you are not slack concerning your promises because your promises to us is yea, yea, and amen. Father God, you said in your word, Lord God, you will never leave us. You will never forsake us. Father God, we know that God, you are God. You are El Shaddai. You are Adonai. Father God, send forth your angels right now, Father God, to make every crooked path straight in every family. Father God, in every country, 
Father God, in every nook, every cranny this morning, Father God. Lord God, we don't want to leave no stone unturned. Father God, remember the pastors, the deacon, the deaconess. Father God, Father God, they are praying. The prayer warriors, the prayer mamas who are praying earnestly every day, Lord Jesus. When some persons are in their bed at three, oh God, your people are on their knees, lying prostrate, praying, seeking you like never before. God, we know you here because you are not a God that is deaf. Father God, we know you know our crisis. God, we know you know our hearts. Lord Jesus and so this morning father Lord we lift you up Lord we magnify you Lord God we glorify you Lord we ask that God you will take full control father God this is the day that you have made we will rejoice and be glad in it most righteous and heavenly loving father remember those oh God who don't know you Lord God, we pray for such a time as this, that they will surrender all to you, Lord Jesus. Father God, remember the backsliders. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. That they will come back to their first love. Hallelujah. That they will turn to you this morning and say, Jesus, all to Jesus have surrender. All to him I freely give. Lord God, you are waiting. You are waiting for your people to turn to you hallelujah and not look to one another lord we know that the foreign gods cannot help because some persons are praying to their foreign gods hallelujah but there is only one and true and living god and that is you heavenly father you who have created the heaven and the earth who have spoke this universe into being Lord God, who hold us in the palms of your hands this morning. Lord, it's not about me. It's all about you. And your people need you, Lord Jesus. Your people need you, Almighty God. We need you, Lord Jesus. Come by here, O oh Lord God. Father God, we know that if we pray, if we truly repent from our hearts, and turn from our wicked and cruel and covetous ways. Lord God, then you will hear from heaven. God, you will heal your land. Father God, you said those in your word. And we know that God, your word will not return void unto you. Jesus, remember. Oh God, the little children, Lord Jesus. We have lost one in this crisis. That child was only four. Father God, the enemy is no joke. Hallelujah. But we know that you are bigger than. You are better than. Hallelujah. And we know that he's already been defeated. The day you went on that cross. Hallelujah, God. And so this morning, Father, take full control. Take full control. Father God, there are families worrying, praying. Father God, the enemy is trying to drive fear in us. Even those that are Christian are being fearful. When you have already told us that you have not given us the spirit of fear, but power, love, and of a sound mind. Father God, you have already given us the weapon. And our weapon is to pray and to worship. Hallelujah. And to worship. And what this nation, this world need to do is to just worship you. Father God, to just worship you. When the children march around the walls of Jericho, they march with praise in their mouths, with the harps, and they sing, and the wall came down. Hallelujah. Father God, it's no much of the shalama shalama, but God to open our sanctified mouths and to worship, and to worship, because when we pray, giants fall. Hallelujah. So God, this morning, have your way. Let your will be done. Let your people know that you are God. And this is no joke. Father God, hear our prayers now. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. 
Father God, remember those that are shut in. The elderly who is helpless, send help. Father God, remember those behind bars. God, having their family out in society don't know where, when, and how. But remind them, Lord God, that even though they're, they too are shut in, they're not shut out from your presence. Paul and Silas, they sang praises and the chains were removed. Now, Lord God, their chain and lock my not, hallelujah, glory be to God, physically be moved. But when they pray and worship their spirit, it will spiritually be removed. Hallelujah, glory be to God. So this morning, Father, take full control over your world, your world, your universe that you have created, that you spoke into being. Let there be and it was. No, Lord, we are asking you because you have given us the authority to do so. So, Father God, we are asking you this morning. We are asking you this morning, Father, for mercy. Mercy. Mercy, Lord. Mercy, Father. Mercy. We ask for mercy because only you, only you, Lord, only you can, only you will. And your people need to know that you are God. To wake up, open up their eyes and see what is going on around them and turn to you, Yahweh, Yahshua. The I am that I am. Rabo shete yanda yalabasata. To turn to you. Not to Allah. Not to Buddha. Not to Krishna. Whatever God it is. That some of them worship. But turn their eyes up to the Lord. Lift up their eyes to the hills from whence cometh their help. Knowing that their help comes from God. Only you heavenly father. Jesus, he said the weapons of our warfare are not carnal but mighty through the pulling downs of strongholds. Hallelujah. So Father, this morning we pulled down every stronghold. We pulled down that stronghold of COVID-19 that is trying to destroy your people. Father God, we pull it down now by the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. And Father God, we send up our praise because we know when our praises go up, then our blessings will come down. Our healing will come down. Father God, we know in all this is going to come forth good. We know that your people will know you now for who you really are. Jesus, we ask for your strength because Father God, you said that when we are weak, that's when you are strong. Father God, you said, our, you, you, you said in your words, Almighty God, that you will never leave us. You will never forsake us. Father God, with all that is going on, you still hear and answering prayers. You are still working behind the scenes. And so this morning, Father, as I pray and as I humbly ask that you will heal our land, heal our world, touch your people, save those that need to be saved hallelujah glory be to god be with us this morning give us your strength this morning those that are weak and strengthen them this morning those that are broken comfort them this morning those who are in need and in lack provide for them this morning you are our jehovah jara or jehovah nissi Father God, you are the God who knows all things. Nothing is hid from you because you sit on the circle of this earth and you look down on your people. Father God, you have done it before and so God, we know that you can do it again. Do it again, Jesus. Do it again. Heal our land again. Save your people again. Hallelujah. In these tough and trying times, show yourself strong. Show yourself strong in Jesus' name. My people, my people, 
This is the word of the Lord. Trust your God. Trust your God. Trust your God. Turn to your God. Look to him this morning. The one who can save. The one who delivers. And the one who heals. The one who knows all your fears. The one who knows you by name. The one who have created you. Hallelujah. Be blessed. Stay safe. In Jesus' name, amen.